guys, welcome back to my channel, uh, Moni Roni, aka Simone Renee. Uh, I have been out for a while. You guys know I've, uh, I'm recovering from a car wreck for those who missed my last video. Nonetheless, um, it is indeed a pleasure to be making this video and sharing a little piece of my life with you guys. It's going to be a very short video. Uh, still on... Uh, self-care very sharp very sharp very sharp so uh make sure that you subscribe like comment uh down below um if you have already subscribed make sure to tell at least two three people about me and um yeah so let me jump right in so uh my skin and i don't know if you can see it's not, let me see. Bring this. it's not, oh my, it's not so, mm, I don't know. I think I have oily skin and so certain times of the year, um, my face tend to break out. And I mean, it's not all that noticeable. However, uh, I'm always looking for um, some type of skin regimen to help with the uh, excessive oil in my skin. Um, and so I am currently trying uh, the Walmart brand of, what is it? Blackhead Clearing Scrub. And so, you just uh, moisten your face with water and you put some on your fingertips and just kind of rub it in. And then I I took the liberty of buying me like a little uh, scrub brush for my face. So after I get it all in, then I just kind of, you know, exfoliate it. Um, and this is an exfoliating scrub. So uh, it has crystals in it and it's supposed to clear up blackheads and be oil free and remove dirt and oil and uh, gently exfoliate your skin. Um, it feels amazing. Um, you know, it's mentholated, so it gives you that fresh feel. And then afterward, you know, and I, I tend to do it like at the start of my... Uh, bath and I just let it sit on my face for a little bit and then I remove it uh before I before I bathe so I let it sit on there for a good 10 five ten minutes and um it feels so nice and refreshing I mean you guys know the uh methylating feeling and so it just feels so nice and refreshing and it tends to uh your face feels like tightened you know that that you know it's it's tightened you know and i love that so um i am here just to share that tidbit of information and let you guys know what i'm into um this is the first day that we've had lights um today is thursday since monday um we're still in the middle of the um winter storm Although we've had no lights and no water, I really can't complain. Um, we've had no busted pipes. Um, you know, God is amazing. He lets you know that he's God and he's God all by himself. You don't want to sit in a quarantine? No problem. He's in control. You see what he did, huh? I'm not mad at him. In fact, I have somewhat enjoyed, uh, you know, being at home when the lights, anticipating the storm, we charged up everything that we could, tablets, phones, uh, battery packs, um, you named it, we charged it. So when the lights was off, of course, you know, you get your rest, you get your rest, you get your rest. Um, I do have a gas range, and so um, I'm so thankful that I grew up with my grandparents and their knowledge of survival. 
And so that was passed on. So, you know, we turned the burners on to heat the house up. Um, I do have two fireplaces, one in my living room, one in my bedroom. However, um, they're electric. So no heat there. But nonetheless, we have uh we have plenty of blankets. Uh you know, we we all cuddled up in a theater room and um watched movies via um sometimes we watched it on cell phones, other times we watched it on tablets. Um you know, the water came on for just a little bit, but it was enough time for us to hurry up, take baths, then fill the tubs up with water to flush the toilets um, for us to urinate and defecate as need uh, be. Uh, for that, I am so thankful. Uh, the electricity is on now. We're not sure how long it's gonna be on. Um, nonetheless, uh, everything is, is panning out, you know, the way God intended. And, um, I just wanted to share that, that, you know, I truly have peace in the midst. And not only that, today is our Boston's baby, our fur baby, second birthday. So, we are going to celebrate him. He gets a nice little treat today. I uh, really am afraid of dogs, so there will be no parties that involve other dogs. Um, us, humans, um, but the roads, you know. So, but it, it, we have put up a birthday banner in his honor over one of the fireplaces. Um, he has birthday attire. Um, I'm sure I will post, uh, you know, uh, he can't have pineapples, his doctor says, so he loves it. So that's his treat, pineapples, and we're going to take good care of our Boston baby today. So that's all that I have for now. Thanks for tuning in, and until next time, ta-ta.